What is up guys, this is Kobe here and today we are going to be looking at 4th Chop Ilium all the way to level 141. Now my bishop isn't here because this game is still patching. Um, I haven't patched it from the update that happened a few days ago, so I'm doing that right now. But anyway, um, I figured it's time to showcase the 4th Chop. So, the crystal ball still only goes up to 150. So you see it's still, you know, around me and whatnot, it's right there. Um, so, you know, it's still the usual stuff. Um, Javelin still increases the uh, gauge by one and then we also have the energy ball that increases it by two but then we have a new skill I don't even know if I have it uh, to, yeah I don't even have it in or not uh, but it's called Longinus Spear I'm pretty sure I saw this last episode but what this does it, in it increases the stacks by three when it's used it goes straight to the crystal ball and the reaction skill that it activates is the first one here. Uh, so this is the only skill that activates this reaction. And then we have Javelin that activates this reaction. And then we also have Long and the Spear that activates the other reaction as well. Um, it seems like we have those weird little things coming out when we use Javelin now. Um, it's, I don't know what that is, but it seems like it's doing some extra damage. So it should help us with training, I guess. And then we have... Oh, this skill's a 30 second quit on level 1. Okay, so that explains it. But yeah, Long in the Spear. High damage. Does a lot of damage when you use it. And pretty much that same damn thing. Um, and it increases the stat count by 3. So that's really, really good. And I want to make sure I do have my summons out. And there's also a new summon that for the job. Oh, maybe not new, but it's combining Makina and Rio into Deuce. This, which is this summon right here. I do need a stat count of 90 to activate it though. So we can kind of hurry up and get that. So I'm kind of sure you guys what's about to go, um, what's about to go down with fourth job. Um, and there's also a new skill that we get for glory ring. And if you guys don't know what glory ring was, that was, um, the skill that required 150 stacks to get. And you just fly around the map killing everything. I don't have that skill. I do not have that skill unlocked yet. Um, so I'm, you know, gonna have to get that, right? Um, want to level up or whatnot. But yeah, this is Deuce right here. You combine the two of them into this ultimate robot. And he pretty much just follows you around. And the damage he does is really, really good too. And then he has like satellites, a whole bunch of satellites that do the same exact damage as Rio. So it's like a whole bunch of Rios coming around and whatnot. Unfortunately, Deuce's duration isn't very long, and you can only use them once per, um... You, you can only use them once every time you hit 90 stacks. If you want to use Deuce again, you got to activate Glory Ring to reset your stats and get 90 stacks again. And that's basically just how that works. And yeah, that's fourth job. Um, I'll be going over some more of the new, newer skills once I hit around 110 or so, uh, but that's just what I wanted to get out first. Alright, level 110 now, around level 104, so I brought the bishop over here, finally finished patching, so levels went by a little quick. Uh, I didn't use a 2x coupon, just because I was saving that for Blue Ghost Pirates, but anyway, we have 41 skill points that we can uh, throw in. Um, I did say I was going to show you guys Glory Wings, so let me go ahead and bring this over here and just charge it up. Um, other skills that you know the passives there, there's actually a really really good passive this skill right here increases your boss damage your ID and your final damage we all know how good final damage is oh shit rarity 136 um let me go ahead and just slap my points into the skill so you guys can kind of see the increase let me go ahead and um put points in there as well as you can see my final damage is already being increased by 10 percent at level 10 with this skill uh, we are still going to be putting more points to it. We're going to max it out. Um, go 20. That's 15% final damage. And get this match to level 30. And then there we have it, level 30. And I'm now I'm at 20% final damage. We all know how good final damage is, right? So this is actually really, really, really good. Um, there's also this stack passive, which, you know, makes you go up to 10 stacks. 10 stacks increases your magic attack by a lot. Uh, so that is, you know, one good thing. Although I'm probably not going to get that just yet. We're going to wait and see what happens. I do need to hurry up and back some of my third job skills, though. Because there are um, some consequences that I have. 
as in like I can't level up a certain skill and so one of my skills are maxed out and whatnot um but yeah we still have the attacking skills on there and whatnot um the main thing I wanted to show you guys was the glory wing skill at um well the skill that you can use in glory wing and I also figured out that you can use the laundry to spear in glory wing as well and here we go this is glory wing and the skill that does a massive amount of damage is this right here as you can see, I'm hitting lines of 800Ks, and it's only at level 1. At level 1, it does 840% damage. At level 30, it does 2000% damage. And you can also use Launching Spear and uh, Glory Wing as well. So that's also really, really nice. And as you can see, I did a ton of damage in that. Um, I actually don't even know if Glory Wing increased. Oh, 10% damage increase. Alright, makes sense. Uh, but yeah, that's basically the skill that I wanted to show you guys and whatnot. Uh, so pretty much already covered everything else and yeah so without further ado it is time to go ahead and go to Google Ghost Pirates we've made a few upgrades and now we're at 70k range with Maple Warrior uh, maybe we made too many upgrades for this level but it, it, it's okay we just go ahead and pop uh, my buffs on the Bishop we're at 77k we're also be popping our Union and the Monster Park buffs as well, and that will grant us that 89k, and then boom, boom, 95k range. Not too bad. I personally think it's pretty good, uh, but we are going to go ahead and see how much damage we do here. We'll go ahead and try our damage with the speed. Oh, somebody's here. Ooh. Let me go ahead and chase. Okay, now now we're back and. Uh, shouldn't be interfering anybody, but we're gonna go ahead and check out our damage now. Um, I'm pretty sure that was like a what? I didn't even hear anything. Okay. Um, I'm gonna pretty sure long did like 700, 800 Ks. Not too bad. Um, gonna bring it down here. Two reactions. Reactions is around 400 K. I don't know. This class feels kind of weak with the range that I currently have right now. Maybe I just need to train a bit more, and then we'll kind of see what happens. But right now, I'm I'm not really feeling the damage. We'll kind of see, you know, a little bit more once we get to around the... Hold on, let me get over here. And you spear. Spear hit nothing again. Alright, I don't know. This class just feels kind of weird. Here, we'll go ahead and use a B buff. Over here. Use a skill. Oh, 1.3 mil. Okay, so we're hitting millions now. No, uh, not too bad. You gotta go ahead and bring it over here too. And the Rio's probably attacking something else. At least we took down the Elite sort of fast, I guess. But, you know, I'm still feeling kind of meh about this whole thing. We'll, we'll, we'll keep training and see how it goes.
All right, level 130 now. Um, being this high of a level on the class so far, and you know, maxing out as many skills as I could while I was training, um, it's actually not that bad. I mean, it's not the best, of course. You know, some of the delays that happened in the test server kind of ruined the class a little bit. Um, I do like Kodina much better right now, in my honest opinion, but it's not really that bad because. Um, with, let's see, I have 121k range, um, Jalen does around 800k, well, up to 800k on these guys, uh, that's not really too bad, considering that I don't really get most of my damage from Jalen, I do get, you know, reaction skills, summons, um, the glory wing, all that kind of stuff on this class, uh, ooh, I'm in my stream, uh, there we go, <laughs> um, but yeah, it's actually not that half bad, or not that bad at all but it can be so much better in my honest opinion i know a lot of people that said well yeah i do know several people that said you know ilium isn't really you know quite the best it's not um as strong as i thought it'd be etc etc and yeah i do have to agree with them ilium does deserve to be much stronger but right now well, considering that I do have, you know, am geared up and whatnot with almost 3k stat at level 130, it's not too bad, but like I said, it could be better. So anyway, it is time to hit 140 and do Monster Park from 140. We are one monster park away from 141, but I've never actually told you guys the worst thing about this class. I only told you, you know, some ups and downs about it. Um, <laughs> there is, I'm pretty sure this, I might have said this before back in the past two episodes, but if you fly, you are prone to get disconnected. It doesn't, it's not guaranteed to happen, but there is a small chance that you will get disconnected upon flying. And what I mean by flying is, oh, what got the fucking stat? But anyway, flying like this, there is a small chance that if you use it a little bit too much, you, you get disconnected. Uh, so the objective here is to not clear Monster Park, but to clear it while flying without disconnecting. Now, the first run took us about three tries to do that. I'm really hoping we can do the second run on our first try. And if we can't, then that 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 that's a wrap. But yeah, the uh, summons on Ilium, the damage is you know okay here in this hell. I'm telling you, it's pretty good damage. Um, what I really really don't like though is the spear skill. Like the spear skill, it's always facing the ball. No matter what way you're facing, it's always gonna go towards the ball. And the whole ball system isn't really my type of thing. Which is why, you know, there's a 0% chance of me ever main this class. Um, I mean, of course I'm going to stay at Dark Knight main for good, but this is just guaranteed to not main it. I mean, the ball system, or whatever it's called, uh, it's not hard. Not hard to control. But at the same time, it's not very fun either. There we go. You see, we're already at stage 5. Gotta make our way through. The lag spikes that I'm getting are kind of making me scared. Because that's, you know, how you kind of disconnect when you fly. Like, there's going to be a short little lag spike. And then you just DC. Um, I'm surprised they haven't fixed that within the latest patch. I thought they were going to. Because the latest patch was Ilium's fifth job. And they just said, nah, nah. We, we made flying faster, right? Because, you know, it is actually really fast now. 
but you can still disconnect upon flying so it's like okay thank you for that like uh, now I don't know what the, what the hell they were doing I'm gonna use this skill real quick uh, am I at 30 stacks I can't even use it whatever probably used it before there we go clear all right all right let's not disconnect here uh, ah perfect we didn't DC but it has happened several times while I was trading today and it was it, it's not very fun uh, but yeah, that's it. We are level 141. Let me go ahead and get out of here and press the NPC chat at. I'm pretty sure I'm pressing the NPC chat button. But I, well, let me just click on the NPC. Um, I'll go ahead and get out of here and I can show you guys my current union level. And it is 6,727. So it should be. 6,786 upon reaching level 200, meaning I'll be 214 levels away from 7k. So in order to get 7k, I'd probably have to level up about uh, three more of my classes, to 200 and whatnot. Uh, that shouldn't be too hard. I know Blaster's going to be one of them, Aron's going to be another one, and you know, th those are the first two that were on my poll at least. <laughs> but yeah, um... Next episode, I will be covering some more of the hyper skills. Uh, this one, I'm not really too sure what this does exactly. I need to, you know, kind of research more on what this means. Um, I mean, I, I can, like, it translates to something regarding the class, but I still don't know this class very well, so I don't know what it does. So, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and get to 150 next episode and kind of just figure out what's going on. We'll be getting to 170 as well to test this thing out too. This seems like it'd be pretty strong. Uh, but yeah, that is it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Really do appreciate it. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like. Subscribe if you haven't. That is if you want to. And I'll be bringing back some more good content to you guys later. Peace out, everybody.